Hello my gorgeous people and welcome back to my channel. I hope you're all having a fabulous weekend and I am so beyond grateful that you're here. Today we are going to be talking about Mr. James Charles. As most of you probably know, James Charles got in some trouble this weekend for sure. For some very serious accusations at that. And of course we're going to run it all down. You guys honestly I'm not surprised by these accusations but it is heartbreaking to me because James seems to not be held accountable for anything that he does and he always seems to get out of everything that to me is disgusting and heartbreaking but I don't know you guys I digress on Friday February 26 the youtuber issued a statement in response to the new social media videos in which a 16 year old that we're not going to name because he is 16 years old accused James of sending him explicit images the teen also claimed that James asked them for photos and videos of their in quotation mark body. In his statement, James said, the accusations that I have groomed this person is completely false. James admitted to exchanging photos with the team, but said he was under the impression the individual was 18. Last week, I came across someone on my Instagram explore page, saw he followed me and added him on Snapchat. The influencer said in this statement, the next morning, I woke up to several snaps from this person and being excited, I added him back. Apparently they were saying things like they loved him and that they were a 18 years old so this made James feel like it was okay to flirt back in the excitement of meeting someone I thought could be potentially great I didn't ask for a copy of their ID or passport it's now clear based on the video that they uploaded they were taking photos of me with another device and had an ulterior motive from the very beginning the beauty vlogger says that he later learned the person was actually 16 years old at which point he apologized and told the individual he was uncomfortable with the situation. However, James claimed the minor insisted on continuing to talk, saying it could be their little secret. They were a fan of his and would never tell anyone. James allegedly said that he was not okay with this and started to get upset. And at that point, James unfriended them. James concluded his message by saying, because of situations like this, instead of taking someone's word for it, I will now ask to see the ID or passport of every person I have a conversation with. At this point, E! News, which is where I am actually reading this article from, have reached out to James Reps for a comment and they have not received anything back yet. You guys, I really truly wish I could sit here and say that this was surprising to me or that I'm shocked, but unfortunately, due to the fact that that James Charles has been caught doing things like this in the past this is not surprising at all it's actually really really sad and it's really serious stuff <laughs> I don't understand how influencers continue to get away with things like this Jeffree Star James Charles you know Tony Lopez there's so many different influencers who have been caught doing things like this and talking to minors and somehow it gets thrown out or it gets swept under the rug but at what point will people finally start start to hold him accountable and other influencers who do this disgusting behavior that's the big question throughout all of this i don't think that james is even the least bit concerned about any of this because as i just mentioned he has tons of money and he can pay this person off or do whatever there is a lot of people speculating that this kid did this for clout including james charles and that very much could be i mean that is definitely a possibility but does that make this any less serious I don't think so. It is not the child's fault that James Charles fell for the situation. It is definitely not the minor's fault that James responded back with explicit photos. I mean, he is a minor and although it's not okay to try to take advantage of people in that nature, at the same time, well-known influencers like James Charles should not be able to be taken advantage of so easily. Now you guys know when it comes to any type of an opportunity to bash James Charles, Trisha Paytas is a right there ready to rumble. Of course, she put some tweets out about the situation. The first one reads, anyone defending James Charles right now is probably underdeveloped mentally as well as very young. Know that this is not appropriate. It is not okay. Grown adults have no business flirting with you. Children see this as a 
cool because they idolize. There is long-term damaging consequences. And I do agree with the statement. I mean, there's a lot of kids out there. Look at the Onision situation and all of the kids that are still dealing with damaging consequences. A lot of these types of kids who believe they have a relationship with someone that they idolize actually have to get therapy and it does cause long-term damaging consequences. So I do agree with her tweet here. And then of course she did do a video about the situation here on YouTube as well and tweeted that over saying James Charles is sick in the head and needs serious help. And then last but not least, this was 23 hours ago. It says, dude, what James Charles has just admitted to sexting with a minor. Do not victim shame, period. But victim shaming a child is disgusting. Do not put blame on someone else for your grooming predatory ways. And I fully agree. Once again, you know, in James Charles statement, which I will pop up here, you can see that he does say that he thinks the kid did this for clout. But as I just mentioned a few minutes ago, does that even matter in this situation? I don't think so, but you guys definitely leave your thoughts in the comments down below. What do you think of all of this? I think it's absolutely disgusting and it's actually really sad as well because I can almost guarantee that James is going to get away with this yet again. At some point though, he will have to answer for the things that he does, whether it's now or five years from now, if he continues this behavior, it's going to catch up with him. That is it for this one, you guys. Let me know your thoughts in the comments down below. Also, if you want to stay in the loop with every Everything going on in the drama world be sure to hit that subscribe button and tap the bell for post notifications that way you are notified every single time i upload i appreciate you guys too the moon and stars and until the next time guys Mwah. bye